Hello everybody, we are going to be playing some Super Mario Bros. 3, and I hope you enjoy the video. We're going to just start with World 1. World 1, level 1. I'm playing on the Wii U, so the controls might be a little off. So if my gameplay seems slippery, you don't know why. This is actually the very first game I probably ever got addicted to in my entire life. Not the first game I ever played, but the first game I ever got like super addicted to. And I'm not doing a very good job. I usually play much better than this, but I'm doing a terrible job with that. Oh, I almost fell down that hole. I need to pay attention to what I'm doing. I'm playing like a new. Alright, let's move on to level 2. I'm trying to debate if I want to skip level 3 or 4, because I usually skip one of these two levels. Uh, and then just go directly to the mushroom house to get an item. I think I might skip level 4, I'm not sure. I think level 3 or 4 might be easier though, so I might skip level 3. I think it's just a matter of opinion. We'll figure it out when we get there. I'm gonna skip level 3. Let's jump right to level 4. I think it's just a slightly easier than level 3 is. Just slightly. Because this one you're mostly, even though the screen moves, you're mostly just hopping on platforms. That's pretty much the entire level. some extra points. But yeah, this is pretty much the entire level. You're just kind of hopping from platform to platform. It's pretty easy. Level 3, I think, has a little bit more, in my opinion, it kind of has a little bit more ball. So. Oh man, I messed up on that big time. Do y'all guys call the Koopa Troopers, do you call them turtles or do you call them Koopa Troopers in this game? They look so much like turtles in this game, it's just it's such a habit for me to refer to them as turtles. In the later games, they kind of stand up upright a little bit more, which is a little bit more cool. But in this game, it's like they're so slouched over and they just look so much like a turtle. So, which I guess they essentially kind of are. Are Koopas supposed to be like modeled off dinosaurs or are they just supposed to be like really buff looking turtles? Not that I really need the flower for me. Good thing is, is there's a leaf at the end of the world. So I can get my, um, get my suit done. Oh, that's what I need. There's a secret passageway that everybody knows about at this point. If you've ever know anything about this game, pretty much everybody knows about this point. Oh, that's what I need. Oh, that's what I need. Oh, that's Save your progress. Sure, not that I really need to. But level 5 is a piece of cake. It's kind of funny that level 5 is actually kind of easier than even some of the earlier levels, in my opinion. I mean, literally, like, once you learn the way to go in this level, it's like, it's easy as crap. 
because all you do, anybody who's ever played this game knows, you just pop up that first uh, hole there, and then you just stay up on top the entire level, just hopping. Now, I could admit, like, maybe the first time you play this level, it might get a little confusing, because, oh, I messed up on that. It might get a little confusing, because maybe you don't know which way to go, but, like I said, it's one of those levels, once you figure out which way to go, it's really easy. It's like, you can literally beat it in, like, less than a minute. So, and that's, so, kind of makes it easier than this level 1 and 2 and 3, really, and 4. in the world did I do that? That's not what I meant to do. I told you guys, I'm playing on this Wii U gamepad, so. So let me off a little bit. So now I'm playing this game like a noob. This is it, but yeah, I think I mentioned that. This is actually one of the very first video games I got super addicted to. I think the very first video game I ever played was Super Mario Land for the uh, Game Boy, the original Game Boy. But this is the very first game I got, like, super obsessed with. So I would literally be, like, in school thinking about it all the time, thinking about this game, like, oh, why do I want to play this game? <laughs> Y'all guys ever have a game like that when you were kids? Just, like, sit there and just think about it, like, the whole day at school, and just be, like, wishing you were at home playing that game? Yeah, this was, like, one of those games for me. I was literally trying to fly when I was doing that because I forgot that I didn't have to do it on it. I was sitting there tapping the A button over and over again. <laughs> oh, that was a mess up. Keep missing it. Oh, good, I got my big man here. Oh, no, I didn't. Gosh. Maybe in the next world I'll do a little better job. <laughs> I'm not showing my skills very well in this first world. Maybe in world two. I'm gonna go for the third one. That's okay. Can be useful in some levels. Oh, it's terrible. The king has been transformed. Please find the magic one so we can change him back. And he's gonna transform back to a snake looking man. Why in the world they would transform into a snake, I don't know. It's kind of easy to play these levels as a, like, a small man, but even though you kind of want to be a big man, so that way when you face the boss you have some more chances, but it's honestly kind of easier to put, do these ship levels um, as a small man, because it's much easier to dodge the bullets, or at least in my opinion, kind of, but it is nice, like I said, to have a big man when you fight these bosses, because then it gives you, you know, more chances to get hit if you, uh, you know, if you get hit. I always try to try to catch the wand in midair. Oh, I missed it. I always like to catch it like every couple times I try to do it. I'm back from my old self again. Thank you so much. Here is a letter from the princess. If you see any ghosts, be careful. They will give chase if you turn away. I have enclosed a jewel that helps protect you. The pea power, or the pea wing, as some people call it. I always called it pea power, but I think most people call it the pea wing. Anyway, guys, I think I'm going to end this video off here. I hope you enjoyed it. And in the next video, I will uh, work my way.